YouTube, thank you for stopping by. Um, I just wanted to do a quick tutorial on how to butterfly a lobster tail. Um, it's 2011 and we had lobster tail and crab legs and what else? Um, prime rib uh, for New Year's and New Year's Day. So I have this beautiful lobster tail here that we're going to just cut up and then we're going to put it in the oven and we're going to marinate it with a little butter and smoked paprika. So I'm going to put it down here so you can... Alright, so I've got just some shears and I am going to turn the tail away from me and then I'm just going to start cutting. I'm going to put my scissors right underneath it and then I'm just going to cut back. Okay, and I'm going to cut as far back, just about to the tail. Maybe a little bit farther. I'm just going to kind of pry it. Alright, that's good. Alright, so now that we have it cut, I'm just going to start kind of prying it open. Okay, now from here, what I want to do is I want to get it pulled from inside so this is all going to come up and over. Okay, so basically, hopefully you can see this, I'm putting my thumbs underneath and I'm just going to kind of tear it from the back. Hope you can see this. <laughs> okay, and see? just pulling up. I'm just going to keep, I think that looks about right. I'm going to put this back like that. Alright, so that's a nice little piece of meat. Okay, and then what I like to do is I'm going to Put some butter and then I like smoked paprika a lot. I have it ready to go. So basically I'm just going to put it, I have my oven preheated to 400. I'm going to put it in the oven for probably about 10 minutes. All right. And I'm going to add just a little bit of water on the bottom. And that's it. So just cut through the shell, pull up the meat, um, add a little bit of butter before it's cooking, and then when you pull it out you can add butter. and. You don't even have to add butter if you don't want to. Um, you can add some lemon juice and put the cover on it and it'll steam it. So that's it. Thanks for stopping.